Darius Rucker argued Morgan Wallen deserves to be embraced by the music industry again, more than three years after Wallen was caught on camera using a racial slur. During an appearance on the Rolling Stone Music Now podcast Tuesday, July 2, Rucker, 58, was asked whether Wallen, 31, should be forgiven for his actions. Rucker did not hesitate, saying, yeah, I do. I think Morgan's become a better person since that, the Hootie and the Blowfish frontman said. I've known Morgan a long time. Since all that happened, Morgan's tried to really better himself and become a better person and see the world in a much better way. In February 2021, TMZ posted a video of Wallen using the N-word after a night out with friends. Wallen released a statement saying he was embarrassed and sorry and made a promise to do better. Despite continued commercial success, Wallen's song, Last Night, was number one on Billboard's Year End Hot 100 in 2023 and his collaboration with Post Malone, I Had Some Help, has been number one on the Hot 100 for six consecutive weeks, the star still hasn't been fully accepted back by the country music industry, at least according to Rucker. He's not forgiven, Rucker added. Morgan is still not out for CMAs and ACMs. They can say what they want, but the fact that Morgan Wallen's not up for Entertainer of the Year at those things is crazy. For the record, Wallen was nominated for Entertainer of the Year at the 59th Annual Academy of Country Music Awards in May, losing to Lainey Wilson. Wallen was also nominated for Male Male Artist of the Year, Album of the Year, Single of the Year and Music Event of the Year. Wallen was also nominated for Entertainer of the Year at the 57th Annual Country Music Association Awards in November 2023, losing once again to Wilson.